Hey, it's Thomas here, and today we're gonna to be checking out the Abyss Professional DC Pumps. If you've got a really big reef system or a ton of head height to overcome because your aquarium is a floor above your filter room and still want the control, low power consumption, and the cool and quiet operation of a DC pump with a professional grade build quality and backed with an incredible 10 year warranty, then you've got to check out Abyss. These German made pumps are absolutely incredible. Titanium impeller, tungsten carbide shaft, what? Most reefers are familiar with the benefits of DC return pumps, like the fact that they are much quieter, have controllable flow rates, and in some cases can even be programmed with dynamic flow patterns for applications like a closed loop. But for those reefers with huge aquariums or who have their filtration rooms the floor below the aquarium, for years now, direct drive pumps have been one of the only feasible options. And they do have some drawbacks, like they tend to be louder, the motors can run very warm, they consume quite a bit of electricity, and they need to be mounted externally. They're also traditionally a little bit more cumbersome when it comes time to do maintenance, and they don't offer any real control options beyond just on and off. But the good news is they're no longer the only option for those types of installs. Abyss has taken the DC return pump to all new heights and engineered their DC pumps to outperform direct drive pumps in basically every category, performance and efficiency, installation flexibility, controllability, overall build quality and components, warranty, size, ease of maintenance, you name it. Whether you have a tank that needs a return flow rate of 2000 gallons per hour or less, or over 12,000 gallons per hour, Abyss has a pump to fit your system. In the box, you'll find the Abyss pump with a 6.5 foot power cord, the controller and driver, the locking power cable, the accessory cable, the pipe adapters, owner's manual, a certificate with the manufacturer date, a warranty card, and a pen so you can fill out the included warranty card and claim that 10 year warranty protection. 10 years! The Abyss pumps currently come in four sizes. The flow ratings range from 2,200 gallons per hour all the way up to 12,700 gallons per hour and have max head heights that range from 19.5 feet up to 41 feet, which is well more than most pumps out there and right in line with some of the more powerful direct drive options. There are also two additional models, which are variants of the A200 and A400 that have an upgraded controller with an IP65 rating for applications where the controller is much more likely to come into contact with spray or splashes. The Abyss pumps can be set up both internally and externally and come with adapters to fit standard North American plumbing. When it comes to installation, the first thing I would do is pick up a pair of unions so that it's always an option to easily remove and maintain the pump or modify and switch up the plumbing as needed. After that, you can use either a barbed connector and appropriately rated soft tubing with a clamp or hard plumbing to connect the pump to your system. One of the things you're gonna notice the second you start connecting the cables to the driver controller box is that the pump cable is made using a heavier gauge than you'd usually see and every cable, the power cable included, has a locking connector. The driver controller box is also extremely well built and while it's larger than what you'd normally see on a DC pump, that's because it holds not just the controller, but the driver as well. Abyss made sure you could mount it to your stand, wall, or controller board with notches to accommodate screws on each side of the box. And following the theme, the pump is also built like a tank with all of the features you'd normally expect to see. But under the hood is where it starts to get really impressive. The impeller is titanium, the shaft is a specialized tungsten carbide, and the pump comes standard with a pre-installed flush bearing and silicone carbide bearings to create a self-cleaning pump that will reduce calcareous buildup and as a result requires maintenance less frequently and lasts longer while also running more efficiently. And if pump noise is something that you just cannot stand, the sinusoidal three-phase synchronous motor paired with those other features make this pump run practically silent. The controller offers flow increments of 1%, giving you plenty of control from zero to 100. You can also use the flow sequencer setting on the control to set wave or random modes to add dynamic flow when using the pump for a closed loop. 
There's also an optional boost mode that will ramp the flow up all the way to max for a period of time to help stir up any detritus in the tank and then move it into the filtration system. And for all of us Apex owners out there, Abyss also makes an Apex interface so you can control the pump through your Apex. And like other DC pumps, soft start as well as dry run, overheating, and even overcurrent protection are all built into the controller. And if by some miracle, this self-cleaning titanium and tungsten carbide pump ever does run into issues, Abyss backs up their pumps with an incredible 10 year warranty. I know I've already mentioned it a couple of times, but if you know me by now, I love a good warranty. And this is by far the best that I've ever seen. And given the investment that you put into a pump like this, I'm grateful to see that kind of commitment from Abyss. It is a testament to just how solid these pumps are. In fact, for some reefers out there, the Abyss A100 that I've got here is going to be a really appealing pump even for more average size reef tanks. Especially if running two return pumps for redundancy just isn't possible due to space constraints. These pumps are just that reliable and well built and Abyss is actually the pump responsible for keeping the BRS-160 running and given how important that tank is, I'm not surprised. With that said, if you're like most reefers and you have a more practical budget and want to find the best pump possible, or perhaps you want to find a pump that also has a very uh, affordable and easily adaptable battery backup option, or maybe even just want a pump that's going to work in the same ecosystem as the rest of your gear, you can check out this video right here where Ryan and Randy go over the top pumps of the year. They're going to talk about all kinds of different brands and why one pump is better than the other for specific categories. So you can kind of figure out what's going to work best for you. Or if you want to see what my favorite favorite pump is in the DC world, um, you can check this video down here and I'm going to tell you all about it. It's the Synchra uh, SDC. Um, yeah, it's that one. That's a, that's a great pump and it's less than half the price of this one. Only a five-year warranty though. That's still five years.